we have seen those harsh temperatures in the Midlands. Triple digit numbers up to 103 degrees have been recorded in the capital city. Being in an air conditioned office or working from home is one thing, but it's quite another if you work outside or if you don't have a permanent place to live. Our Jalen Tart has the latest on what's being done to assist those who have no shelter from the heat. So it's no secret that every summer Columbia gets awfully hot. Throughout the week, temperatures have skyrocketed, which could cause major health problems for those, especially the unhoused. With sun rays beating down, unhoused citizens are constantly looking for shelters or cooling areas in the Midlands, such as Transitions Homeless Center, to cool down. It doesn't matter what the temperature is. We're going to have lots of ice. We've got an ice machine. We've got coolers full of ice. We've got water fountains that you can eat, drink from individually or put a cup in and fill them up. We've got an air conditioned day center. We're in the dorm right now. It's air conditioned. If you get a bed here, that gets you off the street. The center is located on the corner of Main and Calhoun Street, which provides help to the unhoused with essential items such as nutritious snacks, cold water, and cold ice to get them through the heat. According to City of Columbia officials, there are currently 334 unsheltered people in Richland County. I spoke to Chief Meteorologist Adam Clark, who says that hydration and taking breaks throughout the day is key to stay safe while in the heat. He is hydration even if you're not thirsty. Say you're not thirsty, drink something anyway. You need to keep hydrated, especially even the homeless. The homeless needs to make sure that they have plenty of water and that they're not uh, traveling and, and long distances and making sure that they are trying to stay cool and out of the sun as much as possible. The forecast does have a little bit of relief for today and Friday, but over the weekend, Adam says that dangerous heat will return back in the Midlands. Reporting in the newsroom, Jalen Tart, WIS News 10. The city of Columbia will also operate misting stations at area parks to help guests stay cool during the summer months, including Owen Field Park, Martin Luther King Park, Granby Park, Southeast, Rosewood, and Riverfront Parks as well. All of them open from 10 until 6.